My name is Jacob Fatu, the son of the legendary Tonga kid, Sam Fatu. I'm from Sacramento, California, the Golden State. It's nothing but love out there. You know, you can say your life's been rough the whole nine, but uh, overall, I come from a good family. Shout out to my parents. Parents always been good, my siblings. It just ain't been nothing but love, man. But uh, I, didn't, I really didn't grow up wanting to wrestle. I didn't want to wrestle at all. You know, until uh, the day I caught my case for the 211 when I was 18, it was locked down, went to jail. For some crazy reason, every dorm has a TV. It just so happened to be flipping through the channels, right? And who comes on? My brother, the Usos, man, Jimmy and Jay. They coming on and I, rem I will never forget it. They came out with Tamina and uh, they was wrestling against Tyson Kidd, another MLW superstar, Davey Boy Smith and uh, Natalia. And man, when I was 18, locked down, sitting in Sacramento County Jail and I, they was flipping through the channel and I seen my brothers in them. I think that's kind of like where I made my mind up. Funny story was, I used to go to my Uncle Rikishi house every, every summer. And back there, they will have a wrestling ring set up. We had a trampoline, so we'll move the trampoline in front of the wrestling ring, and then uh, right between the swimming pool and the wrestling ring. So the trampoline will be right there. So, you know, when they say, Uso, you do these flips, this and that, that's actually where I learned how to do my backflips at, was at my Uncle Rikishi's house from the wrestling ring, go uh, dive out, bounce onto the trampoline into the pool, man. But yeah, uh, I, I think when I see my brother and them wrestling out there up in, uh, when I was locked down on the TV, they got kind of made my mind up. So at the same time, when I got out of jail, my wife's from LA, everything just fell in place. You know, my uncle Rikishi had a school out there in Los Angeles with Gangrel and uh, my uncle Reno on Hawaii, Black Pearl. So when I got out of jail, When I got out of jail, um, my wife, you feel me? Damn, I didn't know this shit was gonna be like this, you feel me? But uh, shout out to my beautiful wife though, you know what I'm saying? Uh, she had told me, bruh, you keep going to jail, this ain't it, you won't see the kids, the kids need you. When I got out of jail in Sacramento, first day I got out, bruh, she moved me. Uh, she moved me straight all the way to LA. Like I said, that's how everything fell in place. I moved to LA. Out there for a couple months, my uncle Rikishi's son, uh, Tomiko, he's the younger brother of the Usos, had gave me a call and was like, brother, you out here, what you doing? What you got lined up? I was like, man, brother, I'm just working at a, uh, at, a uh, at a bar, bouncing every night for $60. Won't you come give the wrestling a try? I'm like, nah, bro, that ain't good. I really didn't respect the business because it just, you know, I grew up in it. Not, no, not even knowing I was growing up in the business, I grew up in it. You know, live, being at the dinner table, hearing my dad talk on the phone, hearing my uncles come left and right. It get emotional a lot though, you know, cause uh, I see what this business has done for my family, the good, the bad, and the ugly. And man, I also seen like uh, the success though, that you could get out of it. Man, I, I gave it a shot.